Now, have you got any of these in your music classroom? If you don't, then I think it's something you should definitely have a look at, particularly if you're teaching upper elementary or primary age students or even middle school students. Now, the ukulele has been something of a bit of a craze in these last few years, and the reason is simple, and it's this. It's relatively easy to play a couple of chords on it, and you can learn a lot about important concepts in music in a fun way, and students can play familiar tunes. The important thing with the ukulele is to have a starting curriculum that progresses in a logical manner. And when we started researching this area, we found no end to books and resources about learning to play the ukulele. But there was actually nothing to help set up and really help teachers in the classroom to know what to teach and when to teach it and how to progress through in a range of simple tunes that students will like in that logical manner. Now the chord positions aren't hard. The majority of ukulele material can be done with just three chords and that is C, F and G7 chord. What is a little tricky however is changing the chord positions quickly. Getting the chords moving from C to F to G7 really quickly can be quite problematic for new players, especially if they're still learning about musical concepts of beats and rhythms. Therefore, we thought long and hard about this and we came up with a logical step-by-step -step process that will work for any student and a series of well-planned jam tracks that guide the students through this curriculum. So thanks so much for watching and make sure you download the free resource below this video and click the links below to check out the complete product that this resource came from.